Yeah, this was really a bizarre pursuit that lasted for more than an hour. Now, that driver crashed into two innocent people. You can see the family of one of them right here. This SUV is getting ready to be towed off. And this video, this crash, actually happened on camera. Take a look. Well, I spoke to the driver of that SUV. He's an older man. As you can imagine, he's in shock by what happened. He says he was hit and then was unconscious. There you go. You can see that crash right there. Well, now he is in a lot of pain, and he explained to me what happened. Did you see the guy come into you? Where did he hit you from? Right here, right in the front. He hit what part of the car did he hit? The right side, front. And then at that point, you just lost consciousness? Yes. I don't know why he's doing this for us. You know, I heard it was a stolen car. You know, so, you know, hopefully they just catch him and then just, you know, does what he deserves. Okay, so just a few minutes later in North Hills, the driver slammed through this intersection and T-boned this white van. In that same area, he almost hit a group of pedestrians that were in a crosswalk. Thankfully, they stopped the driver in the pursuit while he kept going. Sky 9 was ahead the whole time. And one thing that we noticed during this pursuit is the driver was driving erratic. And at one point, he threw out what appeared to be a lighter. We also saw that there was a black truck that started following the suspect. Well, more than an hour later, the driver of the original pursuit pulled over, surrendered to police, and then the driver of that black truck drove a little bit and also got out and was also taken into custody. It's unknown who this person was or why he turned himself in. Back out here live, though, all we know is this pursuit is over. At least two people are in custody. The driver of this SUV was taken to the hospital. Once we get more information, we'll bring it right to you. Reporting live from Pacoima, I'm Chris Holmstrom, KCAL 9 News. All right, Chris.